What's going on, everybody? Crazy dog. Back again. Day two of free agency is literally like five hours old, technically. Because apparently around 3 a.m., my time, I think that's what they're talking about, Sean Smith went and signed with the Raiders. Now, I had hoped that my Browns would do something on day one. You know, everyone, my predictions, I don't think I did a prediction video, but my predictions were that we would keep Tishon Gibson, keep Travis Benjamin, maybe lose Alex Mack, but keep Schwartz. And then, of course, get rid of Manziel. Well, on day one, we lost all four of those guys and did not retain one. We did not sign a single person. My phone was going off the hook with Adam Schefter, Ian Rappaport, and Aditi Kikabwala talking about other teams signing players. And the Browns didn't do a dang thing. I had, you know, I had predicted mainly, well, I don't think I did it. Again, I don't think I did a video for it. But I really wanted them to sign Marvin Jones. Maybe Adam Jones. Maybe. Um, you know, maybe some other guys. But to not sign a single person? I mean, really? I mean, I get it, like, analytics, analytics, but analytics should show that you need to sign at least one person on the first day. I mean, even if it's like a mid-level player. I mean, yeah, the Browns are going to sign someone soon. I hope. <laughs> they don't. That's going to be pretty messed up. But um, what really kills me is the fact that Hugh Jackson, well, not Hugh Jackson, Sashi Brown, and the front office made it their priority to, well, they said it was their priority to re-sign all their free agents, but yet we didn't re-sign one, and we pulled the offer on the one free agent we uh, had an offer for, and that was Mitchell Schwartz. Although I did hear that the Browns were involved with Richard Matthews uh, early later in the last night, but again, couldn't pull the trigger. God, these this front this front office is either gun shy, like they don't want to pull a you know get a good maneuver, like get a player, or they're gonna do that build through the draft thing, which is probably the most stupidest thing ever. But we'll see. I mean, we still got like several more. Yeah, well, heck, free agency can will go until about pff, June. Of course, I just hope we don't pull off a maneuver like we did with Dwayne Bow last year. <sighs> well, day one was a disaster for the Browns. Let's just hope day two and and beyond is somewhat better. Because losing four players and not gaining one. Well, that's right. We signed Tank Carter. We re-signed Tank Carter. <laughs> Ooh, wow. He's going to be our cap. He's going to He's a, a really good building block. <laughs> wow. We, we re-signed Tank Carter. Yeah. Meanwhile... Out on the West Coast, the Raiders are freaking going around and signing all these good players. I mean, again, they, they signed Sean Smith. They signed Bruce Irvin. They signed Caliche Osemele. Osemele. Uh, that name's going to kill me all year. Uh, it's like, really? The Raiders going out signing all these good players and the Browns don't sign a damn one. <laughs> wow. <sighs> it, it was a rough day yesterday. I will tell you that. It was rough. 
<laughs> rough, rough. <laughs> Get it? It's a dog thing. <laughs> dog pun. <laughs> That's how you know. I mean, I feel bad for Aditi Kikabala though, because like she was at the Browns headquarters for 12 hours yesterday to report a trade or Johnny Manziel getting cut, and nothing happened. I feel bad for her. Being all the way out in Cleveland, expecting, you know, a trade, I mean, not, well, not a trade, but a free agent signing, or at least Johnny Manziel getting cut. None of that happened. So, we'll see what happens. But, like I said yesterday, if and when, mainly if, we uh, sign a free agent, I will make a video about him, maybe talk about some stats from him. Where he came from, and all that good stuff. So, uh, well, I hope day two goes better. Because day one sucked. It was boring and it sucked. Well, anyways, I'm Crazy Dog. I'm always going to rep my brown. Even after this debacle. And, uh, well, I'm out.